Today, overnight, Google announced a massive new investment into artificial intelligence. Despite being a leader in the field for a decade or so, it's recently been surpassed in what's called generative AI. Think ChatGPT or Bing Chat, which Microsoft incorporated into its browser. And it looks like the balloons got cut off in this one. So you can go ahead and reposition the birthday boy. Magic editor automatically recreates parts of the bench and balloons that were not captured in the original shot. Now, ChatGPT, remember, was only released to the public in November last year, yet in that short time, it's radically changed the IT landscape and raised questions about jobs and industries that will change in the future. Microsoft, the owner of Bing, confirmed a multi-billion dollar investment in ChatGPT in January. Google, with its inferior BART app, seemed to be left behind. That's until now. Its new chatbot will soon be available in English across 180 countries and will support 40 languages. So in my mind, imagine a face-to-face -face instant conversation with a person who doesn't speak your language. We have been applying AI to make our products radically more helpful for a while. With generative AI, we are taking the next step. With a bold and responsible approach, we are reimagining all our core products, including search. The new AI search features will include advertisements, important as those ads generated 162 billion US dollars of revenue last year. But that's not all. The folding phone is back. But I've got to tell you also, it's just a little bit different to those old clamshell phones that we all used to have.